السلام علیکم آئی ہوپ یو آل آر فائن ٹوڈے وی ول ڈسکس دا ریمیننگ ٹاپکس آف یونٹ ون وچ از اباؤٹ سیکس سو لیٹ اسٹارٹ ان دس لیکچر وی ول لرن اباؤٹ وین ڈائگرام ہاؤ ٹو ریپرزینٹ آ یونین انٹر سیکشن ڈفرینس اینڈ کمپلیمنٹ تھرو وین ڈائگرام اینڈ اباؤٹ لاز آف سیٹ تھیوری کمیٹیو لو اینڈ ایسوسیٹیو لو اوکے اسٹوڈینٹس بفور اسٹارٹنگ دا لیکچر وی مسٹ ہیو سم آئیڈیا اباؤٹ وین ڈائگرام اسٹوڈینٹس وین ڈائگرام از اے گرافکل ریپرزینٹیشن آف سیٹ دا یونیورسل سیٹ از ریپرزینٹیڈ بائی دا انٹیریئر آف ریکٹینگل اینڈ دا ادر سیٹس آر ریپرزینٹیڈ بائی ڈسک لینگ ود اے ریکٹینگل ایز یو کین سی ان دا ایگزامپل the yellow shaded area is universal set which is a rectangle and the circle or a disc like shape is a set which is the part of universal set here is the representative venn diagrams of union intersection and complement Here is an example which gives the complete idea about Venn diagram. First one is Venn diagram of universal set which contains 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and 7, 8, 9 as its elements. Second one is the Venn diagram which shows a set A which is a part of universal set and set A contains 1, 3 4 5 and 9 as its elements and the third one is a venn diagram of set b b is also the part of universal set and it contains the elements 2 4 6 7 and 8 according to the question we have to show the intersection of a and b so the intersection of a and b can be represented as you can see in this example the intersection of a and b is shown set a and set b with its elements you can see set a and b I have one and three element in common so the Venn diagram of set A and B intersection will be represent as you can see the common element will be right in the middle of the part where both the circles intersect it, each other and after writing the similar elements we will share the area This is the example that shows the union of two sets A and B. Here you can see the elements of A and set B. According to the question, to find out the union, we will combine the elements of A and B, and the common elements will write in the middle of. Uh, of the two circles where they both intersect each other we will shade uh, circle a and circle b and also shade the area where they both circles intersect each other this is how we represent union of two sets through venn diagram here is an example of difference two sets a and b are given first we have to show a minus b and then b minus a for a minus b the colored area of a circle shows the remaining elements of a which do not belongs to set b so the answer is the shaded area elements means 2 4 and 6 similarly for b minus a 
shaded part of circle shows the remaining elements of B which do not belong to set A. So the answer is the element written in the shaded area. In this example, we have a universal set of all natural numbers and a set A which contains all the multiples of 2. Here we have to find the complement. You can see a Venn diagram of A complement. The shaded area of the rectangle shows all the elements of universal sets that are not present in set A. Similarly, in the second example, U is a set contains elements 1 to 9 and A is a set which have elements 1, 3, 5, 7 and 9. Or you can say that A is a set of odd numbers between 0 to 10. The shaded region of rectangle is the complement of set A. Let's move to our new topic related to sets which is set theory laws. First law is commutative law. Commutative law defines for union and intersection that the, that the order of the sets in which we do the operation does not change the result. Means A union B is always equals to B union A and A intersection B is always equals to B intersection A. Second law is associative law. It defines that how the sets are grouped does not change the result. Means, if you have three sets A, B and C, it does not matter that first you do the union of A and B and then C or union of B, C and then A. Similarly for intersection. In this lecture, we studied the concept of Venn diagram, how to represent union, intersection, difference, and complement of two set through Venn diagram. Also, we learned about commutative property and associative property in detail. Hope you have cleared all the concepts about sets. Students, always remember that the practice makes men perfect and math is all about practice. So keep practicing till the next time. Thank you. Allah Hafiz.